This state-of-the-art facility is a first for the continent. It will focus on diagnosing and treating neurological challenges facing Africans. Brain health is one of the key things that we have to protect for us to actually develop Africa in any way. And so therefore the Neuroscience Institute serves as one of the first um, um, institutions that have been set up that can address local issues that affect, the, that affect brain health. The center was conceived in 2015 and is expected to be fully operational in May. The idea is to kind of get the academic activities going and bringing in people from a range of different uh, backgrounds, not only from the medical school and the health science faculty, but also from upper campus. The facility won't only be treating patients, it will provide invaluable training to UCT medical students. I mean, a lab like this and an institute like this is invaluable to student training, um, to bringing guys up to speed with um, what it's like to actually operate in the brain, um, show them a whole new side of, of medicine that a lot of other students in the country and in the world don't get exposed to. It will bring together both the clinical and the basic science researchers. It's like having a hub where we can talk more fluidly and start to generate ideas. Directors at the facility say the plan is also to look at the development of children's brains. Nobesutu Ejana, Cape Town.